me. <laughs> mm -hmm. What I want you to do is kiss the front of it. Where the fuck is Zangie at, dog? Alright. Right. Tell me when to stop. Right, this right is good, dog. Let me. What we're gonna do is I'm going to try. Sipping on cocaine. Uh, new pack of cards. Go like this. <laughs> Make your card jump to the top, okay? So I'm gonna take your six of diamonds, right? Okay. I'm gonna take your card. That's it, right? What? The ace. This isn't your card. No. No, no that was the, that was the sex, the one she kissed instead of hers. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Give him a two-two. All right. Cover your hands like a sandwich. Don't even get to it, all right? Okay. What I think happened was. You kissed the card, the ace or whatever it was. Game was really but we know that. <laughs> so we've never kissed. Ash, no. Ash, so I don't know what it feels like. Oh my god! <laughs> it's like you're trying to play with all. Same thing with this. It'll work. <laughs> It'll work. There you go. Watch. Right. Watch. Watch. Hello. Oh, oh, no. No. No, it's too far. Here, you can. What was your card? It was an ace. Just squeeze the trigger. What the fuck? Oh my god! Get away from me! I don't know how to like word this without sounding like a douche. Someone needs to tell him. If you don't tell him, who's gonna tell him? <sighs> yeah. All right, you guys. The bottom line is, you don't need to use a magic trick to trick a girl into kissing you. Magic is a good opener, it's a good way to show how you're valuable and you can use it as, I always use magic as some kind of trade-off. I'll be talking to a girl and she'll be like, oh I heard you do magic, you have to show me a magic trick, and then I say, well you'll have to give me something of value in return. I never say you have to give me a kiss, I want them to try to come up with something they think is valuable in exchange and that way you can show the magic trick and then lead on to something where they're giving you something in return, reciprocating for what you're giving them. But I never like the idea of like, here, let, like, if this works, like, you'll give me a kiss. I used to be like that, and then as I grew up, I learned that you don't need that to trick a girl into kissing you. Use it to your discretion, and have fun with it and hopefully hopefully you get some kisses out of it This video is brought to you by Audible. Download your free audiobook today at audible.com slash disturbreality. The way you're going to start this out is have a, a lady, someone who uh, you find attractive, if we're going the whole kissing route, uh, a lady or guy in which you find attractive. They pick a card. They kiss it. You put it in the middle of the deck and you control it to the top using your favorite method. And you say, I'm going to make your card jump to the top. That's step one. But you have a double lift here. You took two cards as one. They'll say, no, it's not my card. And you say, oh, now this is the time to play it up like you screwed up. Acting, uh, professional liar in which you are, you magician lying. You say, no, it's not my card. And you just, you know, you play stupid. Wow, are they lying? Is she lying? You're a liar. So you have two cards here, and you say, put your hands out. Oh, I must have screwed up. Here, let me take the jack. I'll put it in your hands, which is now the five. The whole trick is done now. They put it in their hands, cover that bitch like a sandwich. From there, you're going to say, okay, here's where the magic comes into place. You kissed that card, right? You kissed the, the whatever card it was. But we've never met before. We just met today. Uh, so you, you got to give me a kiss. That's the gimmick that you're playing off. Is you don't know what their kiss feels like. If you know what their kiss felt like, then you can find their card magically or miraculously. Um, if you're a gentleman, let them kiss you on the cheek. If they seem to be into you, this is one of those good tricks. If you're talking to a girl and they show, like you show her a magic trick, and then she starts flirting on, flirting with you, and you just are too intimidated to make a move, you can use this trick as a crutch to have her make the move for you because she has to be the one to come in and give you the kiss. So if you want to use it in that regard and work up to 
you know, just making the move down the road in general, you'll get there. Everyone goes through that phase. You can do it. I have faith in you. So they give you the kiss, and then you do your magical gestures of whether you rub, if they kiss you on the cheek, maybe you rub the cards on your face, maybe you take your hands, rub the kiss off, rub it on their hands, do something magical with where they kissed you. And then they will just say, what was the card that you picked? Oh, it was the five of spades. And then you just point, that's all you gotta do. Point to their hands, they'll flip it over, and what was the jack of clubs or whatever has now turned into the card they kissed. And the only reason you found it is because they gave you a kiss, you lucky son of a gun. You know, I like to help my audience not just learn these magic tricks, but learn how to be an entertainer and go out and perform them to real people. Something that helped me was reading self-improvement books. And right now, my friends at Audible are offering my listeners a free audiobook of your choice and a free 30-day trial membership. Just go to audible.com slash disturbreality and choose from over 150,000 titles. Claim your free audiobook today to get a bestseller, fiction, nonfiction, or a self-help book, which I would recommend. Go to audible.com slash disturbreality to get started. Books like Influence, The Psychology of Persuasion, How to Win Friends and Influence People, and The Art of Speed Ring People are all books I would recommend for learning how to better your social skills and confidence. Go to audible.com slash disturbreality to get your free audiobook and 30-day trial today. All right, you guys, so that was the kiss trick. Use it to your discretion. I'm Jarek120. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Jarek120, Facebook.com slash Disturb Reality. Um, use this as a crutch to have her make the move on you and feel them out, feel how they're feeling about you, and it will work out. Be inspired to learn, aspire to disturb, and always rise above. Just pick a goddamn hard.